What's going on everybody? King of Dragons 5000 here coming at you with another episode of It Came From Amazon. Here we do have four packages from Amazon. Now, am I the only one that gets upset when you order something from Amazon and they all ship at the same time and you get four different boxes? I can understand if there was a shipping delay, but the fact that all these got shipped together at the same time from the same distribution center and I get four boxes. Doesn't make sense to me, but anyway, what we're going to do is take a look at what we have in all these boxes, and then we'll see what my haul is, and hopefully you guys enjoy what you see. So let's actually get these opened up and see what's in them. So instead of opening each box individually, I already have one box opened up and everything has already been taken out. So in the first package, we do have the WWE Elite Collection Fan Takeover, Shayna Baszler, Baszler sorry, excuse me. And we do have Shayna here in the packaging, which does look really nice. I kind of wish that this figure came with an alternate head sculpt, but I'll get more on that when we have a look at the actual video. But yeah, really excited I finally have Shayna in my collection. And really glad I did hold off on getting her. I think the previous Elite figure was good, but this one has interchangeable hands and double jointed knees. So I'm going to guess this one is better. So I really do like the fact that we do have a Shayna Baszler in my collection. The second figure we do have is the WWE Elite Collection Fan Takeover Seth Rollins when he took on the Beast Incarnate Brock Lesnar. As you can see he is wearing his gold lined attire which I always love when Seth Rollins wears attires with gold lining. You can see he does have a really nice shirt here. Kind of wish that they did a sculpted vest for him here but he does come with interchangeable hands so I do like that. Uh, not a fan of this particular Seth Rollins face sculpt. I think mine is a little bit wonky, which I do have a head in the way, waiting in the wings for this particular figure, so it's not that big a deal. Really do like that ring gear again. Would have liked it if the vest was sculpted, but I understand why they did it. So yeah, really, really liking this Seth Rollins, so moving that off to the side. And now our next figure. It's not a fan takeover figure. It's actually in preparation for my annual Wrestlemania weekend or week whichever way you want to watch all my videos we have the Wrestlemania Shawn Michaels now I did pick this up on Amazon because it was sold out on ringside collectibles and I was planning on buying the entire way from ringside collectibles so I do have Shawn Michaels here in the packaging you can see we do have Goldberg Shawn Michaels Edge and China really really looking forward to reviewing these figures for you it looks really nice I do have some issues with it but again We'll talk more about the issues when we actually have a closer look at the figure. So, moving Shawn Michaels off to the side. The final figure we will be having to look at from my haul is the WrestleMania Edge. Now, this isn't my favorite Edge figure. I think the face looks... I'll, I'll hold off on all my judgment until the video, but really do like the fact we do get a baseball bat with him. We get the Paul Orendorf hit. Or not Paul Orendorf. Paul Ellering, excuse me. I don't know why I thought Paul Orendorf, but yeah, we do have the Paul Ellering head and torso here. We have a... Wasn't this a rendering for Edge in a video game? That looks like a video game rendering for Edge, doesn't it? I'm pretty sure that was from one of the SmackDown games. I, I don't even remember what number, but that's a video game rendering for Edge. But yeah, we do have the WrestleMania Edge. And just because I'm feeling nice, guys, I'm going to show you what I bought from Walmart getting that off camera we have Goldberg with the Blue Universal title now I am only missing China and again even though I do have these figures in hand you're probably not gonna see a review until Wrestlemania week that's pretty much when I do all my WWE Wrestlemania series reviews so be on the lookout for that guys I am really happy that I did find Goldberg at retail because he is quite expensive everywhere else so with that out of the way guys, let's actually get my little haul out here all together so we can take a look at what I got and then we'll wrap up this video. And so here we do have my Amazon and technically a Walmart haul figure here and you know what, I'm really happy with this figure, with these figures guys, I'm not going to lie, I can't wait to get them open up. Now one issue I do have besides the way they were all shipped to me is that I did not get my Adam Cole and Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, which is really unfortunate because I really wanted to review the entire fan takeover series. 
Those unfortunately got pushed back till April, so I'm not going to be seeing those anytime soon. But I do have them in my Amazon uh, waiting uh, list, the uh, place where they go until they get shipped. But they will be here eventually. I am at least happy I got Shayna Baszler and Seth Rollins because I really love this attire and I really needed a Shayna Baszler in my collection. Really looking forward to doing the WrestleMania figures. Hopefully I can find China at retail, otherwise I'm going to have to go to Ringside Collectibles, which I don't have an issue doing that. I would much prefer finding her at Walmart like I did Goldberg, but again, I'll take Ringside Collectibles if it makes it easier on my gas, especially because gas prices are going up right now. But anyway guys, hope you enjoyed this It Came From Amazon video. I know it is a little WWE heavy, I am doing a little more WWE videos. But don't worry guys, I still have a lot of videos in my uh, queue that I want to do for you guys, especially with the Snyder Cut coming up. I do have a little surprise waiting for you guys that week. So do be on the lookout for my Justice League week and be on the lookout for my WrestleMania week. And then these will probably go up sometime in the near future. So be looking out for those. So with that being said guys, you guys know what to do. Check out all my other action figure videos, my unboxing videos, like, comment, subscribe to my channel. Go check out all my WWE videos. I have a lot of them. And if there's something you want to see me add to my collection, let me know down in the comments. If there's something you want to see me unbox, I'll do unboxing videos for you guys and give first thoughts if that's really what you want to see. And then we'll do more in-depth reviews. So hopefully you guys enjoy this. As always, I love doing this for you guys. I love showing off what I get. So as always, I'm King of Dragons 5000, and I'll see you guys later. Take care, everyone.